Hey everyone, welcome to Kempner Sports. My name is Rev Trev, and today we are going to be talking about Lucas Musgrave. I don't know if you've seen OTAs, uh, Combine, uh, highlights from his college days. He looks amazing. Now, I'm not saying, okay, I'm not saying that he's going to be Travis Kelsey, but doesn't he look a lot similar right now to Travis Kelsey when you see him in uh, running those routes, doing different things? I'm like, wow, he, he just, it style-wise looks really great. Now, um, if you haven't had that like and subscribe button, please do that. Love to support, love to continue to make great content for you. So um, here's the thing. Uh, this NFL um, tight end class was touted to be absolutely incredible. And it is looking like that right now. Um, Green Bay obviously going to get two rookie tight ends for for the offense. Much needed position that Green Bay needed uh, to help with Jordan Love and, and making him successful. Um, here's the thing. These guys come highly touted. And everyone was talking about Kraft and how amazing he is. And I really do hope. But watching Musgrave is like... This guy looks dynamic and he looks special. And there's a lot of a lot of hype about him. But man, if you followed me on Twitter, you saw that I wanted Michael Mayers. Like that is the guy from North uh, from uh, Notre Dame, uh, big huge Irish fan. And man, he didn't end up coming to Green Bay because I think they said Musgrave is the guy we want. And I don't blame them. Uh, Laporta for um, Detroit Lions looks incredible as well. So this is pretty interesting, pretty special moment. You, you know, we haven't even talked about Kincaid yet, but this is what this is so exciting to see these tight ends and see if they're going to live up to the hype. And there's so much around this position that you want them to do well. But uh, man. I don't know. I don't know about you, but it's it's. I'm getting excited to see what he looks like on the field. This guy is six foot six, and, and he can run like four point six at the time. But we ran four point six. Some people say he's run faster than that, and, and it's like, are you kidding me right now? Like, I think he's two hundred and fifty three pounds or something, and, and he's he's moving quickly, and so hopefully he can block well. Hopefully he can continue to run routes, cause separation, but I don't know about you, if you play fantasy football, I've been in my dynasty leagues sending offers for Musgrave now. This is the lowest you're going to be able to get him, uh, but now if he just turns into a bust, you're not going to be having to give up too much for him. I don't know. I think now's the time. Now, I, I know that in fantasy football, you can't go homerish and just go for all Green Bay Packers because we are a huge unknown, but... Listen, it might be now might be the time. It, I mean, you can't get Kelsey. You can't. I mean, there's people who spend a lot of draft capital on Kyle, Kyle Pitts. I mean, he hasn't done anything yet, and he's been a pretty amazing specimen. So hopefully, he puts it together. But if we continue to with the Green Bay Packer talk here, I'm pumped about these tight ends that we got, and especially Musgrave. If you know something about Musgrave that I need to know, post it in the comments. Are you excited that we're, we've got him on team? Have you been pumped about the way he's looking, the potential he has? I would love to hear your comments in the comments, and I'd love to connect with you. So hope you have an awesome day. Like, comment, subscribe, and of course, go Pack Go!